how she ended up, you know, bringing uh, cinnamon and how it all happened. You know? Her dad had, because um, since she can't breed, she's useless to us because we raise, and, you know, she shows cattle. And um, this weekend, he was coming home from work Thursday, coming back into town Thursday. He wanted us to have her ready to load up Friday to go to the sale barn. And, and they test them at the cell barn to see if they're breedable. If not, they go to yeah. slaughter. And it was just uh, by the she grace of God. Home we were going to go to the barn. I just got home. Saw your interview with ABC 13. And I was like, Cinnamon, let's go see. Oh, yes. <laughs> and so crazy. as soon as we got in the truck to go out to feed our cows, and, and I said, she said, let's call him. Let's call him. I said, we have to call your dad first. And let's talk to him and see if he'll let us do this. And he said he didn't care, so we immediately called you and told yeah. you. And <laughs> we, it was perfect. She sent the email from my cell, from my cell phone to you. And, yeah. If it wouldn't for any other reason but to save cinnamon, it's all it was. divine order, and that's our mission. Our mission, you know, is is as a first Texas ranch to do this is to is to be able to reach other ranches mm -hmm. and like y'all, you know. She's and, just and such a, a gentle girl, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Just so gentle. They're cinnamon. Hi, cinnamon. Look at them eyes. Her ears are so long than her face. Aww. <laughs> awesome. I like to play okay. with their Thank you. Appreciate that so much.